Well, NASA has done it again. Let's begin. Okay, first up for today, I've just got to tell you that they've discovered a new planet, and it's 99% of the size of Earth. And yes, okay, I know what you're thinking, hey, who cares? Or maybe, you know, that's amazing. It's like finding a needle in the haystack. But just hold your horses there, because this planet is a few hundred degrees hotter and completes its orbit in about two days. So it's basically like finding a needle in a haystack and then realizing that the need is basically sitting on the campfire for a couple of days. But the real kicker is it's 41 light years away, meaning that it will take 41 years to get there. So the average 20 year old will be a pensioner by the time he arrives. And who knows, any alien life that's on this new planet might not be too welcoming. But let's not be too harsh on this new discovery because after all, it does have conditions similar to Earth. And as one of the team members, Jacob Losting Jaeger, I hope I pronounced that right, said, counterintuitively, it's 100% carbon dioxide atmosphere is so much more compact and it becomes very challenging to detect. Which of course means it's like finding the needle in a haystack, realizing it's been sitting in a campfire for a couple of days, lost its needle-like qualities, and also hiding in a little teeny tiny box, which is 41 light years away. But of course, let's not forget the Jacob Webb Telescope, the JWT, is bringing us closer and closer to a new understanding of Earth-like worlds outside our solar system. So, you know, who knows? Maybe this summer, the team will make some additional observations to find out that this planet is actually a paradise, and we should all pack our bags and move to LHS 475B. Or, you know, maybe they'll find out it's just a needle that has been sitting in a campfire for a couple of days and 41 light years away. And in other news, the JWT also took a look around the dusty disk around the red dwarf star and inside the star forming region in a neighbouring dwarf galaxy. So it's not all bad news. Of course, let's be real. The real headline here is that NASA discovers a new planet that's basically like Earth, but warmer, faster and way further. So there you have it, folks. Another breakthrough discovery from NASA. Even, of course, if they're a few hundred degrees hotter than we're used to and about 41 light years away. Anyway, a new video will be up in a bit. So remember to click that subscribe button down there so you don't miss out. Um, or else. Ha <laughs> ha.